And let's get down at the stock there. Look at how big that's getting. So this is proof that you really can grow celery from a grocery store stock of celery. So my wife decided that she was going to grow some celery from store-bought celery after cutting off that bottom stock. I've never personally tried it and I thought, I want to get in on this action. Let's go check it out. But we got to go back several months into the late winter. Oh, and in this video, we're going to have my first attempt at a very small time lapse of this celery growing. So stay tuned and check it out. So this is her little celery stalk. She cut that sucker, put it in a glass of water, and nothing happened for a couple weeks. All of a sudden, just yesterday, this little whirl of leaves started just exploding out of that little stalk there. Now I got so excited when I saw this, I thought, let's see if my wife can teach me a thing or two about plant propagation. So I got a glass full of water here, and it looks like she used a couple toothpicks here and place it right down in our glass of water, just like my wife did. We're gonna see what happens. So it's been a little over a week and look at how much growth that one little celery stalk has put on. Anyway, I got so overzealous with this that I got a few more going. So we've got four of them total. This was the next one I showed you in the last video and then two more and they seem to be coming up faster and faster but it's still pretty early. It's only March 11th today and we need to do something with these guys, but it's still too cold to get them outside. So I'm gonna pot these up into this little bonsai tray that I've got. One other thing I wanted to show you that I thought was pretty cool, we've already got a little root starting to form on him. Isn't that awesome? All right, so we got all our little celery stalks stuck here in the bonsai pot and they're under the bright lights. Now, because I'm going to really bright lights here and a lot of warmth, I'm sure the tops of these guys are gonna brown a little bit, but I think it's still early enough that we're gonna see this new growth just take off and do well. They are going from water into soil and I think that will encourage more root growth. I did saturate all of the soil, the potting soil here. I didn't do any fertilizer yet. I just wanna see if I can get some good root growth throughout these guys. And if we can do that and start seeing some nice top growth, then I'll fertilize and see where it takes us. But I'm excited to see how this turns out. We'll see where this little celery takes us. You wanna see what happens, stay tuned. So we finally got our celery all raised up here, but it's time to get this stuff outdoors because, you know, summer's coming here and we gotta get all those indoor plants underneath that light set up out of there. So my oldest girl, Allie, wanted to be involved in this one. What do you think, Allie? It looks cool. You like this thing? Mm -hmm. You like celery? Mm -hmm. So what are we gonna do with this now, guys? What do you think we should do with it? Eat it. You like eating celery? Mm -hmm. What do you like to put on celery? Peanut butter. Me too, man. I love celery and peanut butter. So I brought something out here for this fun little event. Ugh. We've got a knife. What else do we got? Peanut butter. That's right. You want to go get the peanut butter? Mm -hmm. All right. Now, of course, these are little miniature stalks of celery, but uh, we can still eat them. <laughs> so we're just going to come in here and we're going to cut a tiny little celery stalk right off of our celery plant. And there it is. Look at that, isn't that cute? What kind of peanut butter are we using? Adams. We like that stuff, don't we? Mm -hmm. What do you think? Here, smell this real quick. Does that smell like some good celery? Mm -hmm. It's pretty strong, isn't it? Pretty crazy for growing indoors under T8 bulbs, guys. Anyway, let's get this party started. All right, let's get this peanut butter out of here. You gonna take a bite? Mm -hmm. I know I wanna take a bite of this stuff. It's <laughs> kinda of funny with this tiny little miniature celery we got going on. Here, you want to take the first bite? Mm -hmm. All right, do it, buddy. Mm. <laughs> That's pretty tough, mm. isn't it? Is it bitter? Mm. This is a little bitter. Here, let's try it again. <laughs> you got to have peanut butter with celery, guys. Look at that little miniature, little tiny miniature <laughs> celery. 
with some peanut butter on it. I think it needs to go out in the garden and get some time growing. That's a pretty tough celery. You want another bite? Or mm -hmm. are you good? You mm -hmm. want to? You like it, huh? You got, come, mm -hmm. on, come on, bite that like an animal. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You want a bite of that? There you go. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think? It's yummy. It's yummy. Tastes way better with peanut butter. That's right. So it looks like you can grow celery in your own home. And uh, you can even eat it. Although it's a little bitter. Uh, it's pretty dark green. I'll bet if we planted this out in the garden now that the weather's warming up. And let it really fully do what it needs to do down in some real soil. It would probably grow a little bit bigger and be full of more water and less fibrous and bitter. It would probably taste pretty good. Anyway, it's the same stuff we bought at the store. But that's it, guys. There's our little celery video for you. That was a fun one to make, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Should we show them the other little project we've been working on? Mm -hmm. Let's show them the other project. Okay. So we've come a long way in this celery video, but I'm not quite done yet. You remember that first celery stalk that I put in the water? Here it is. We just left this thing sitting in this glass of water and it started rooting. It rooted like crazy. Let's pull this out and show you. Got lots of roots on there, but the rest of it started rotting away. But we just left it and eventually it fell down in there, but it's still growing this nice, beautiful green growth here. So I think I want to try potting this up into some potting soil and see what happens from here. So here it is, all potted up. We've got it in one of our giant Dixie cups here. And that celery is looking a little pale out here in natural lighting, but I got it fertilized up. And I think what I'm gonna do now, since we're headed into spring here and things are warming up and just getting real springy and summery out here now, I'm gonna move this guy outside into the hoop house. And I might use some of my slow release fertilizer on this now as well, and just see what it can do. It's just an experiment. Normally in my vegetable garden, I would use only organic you know fertilizers but this is just an experiment I want to see how well this can grow from a store-bought celery stock in a pot in this hoop house so I'm gonna go set it down over here and we'll come back when something happens all right so this is a follow-up to that last little bit we did with the one that rooted in the water and I've had it out here in a while in a while for a while and there it is I don't see any roots coming through yet and it kind of suffered at first but it's still pretty cool out here so all these guys kind of fell back once i took it from the warm house to the outside and they all kind of drooped over but then this new little growth started coming up out of there isn't that cool all right so it's been several more weeks since i did that last little clip of video but that's what we've got so far it's starting to grow new green growth really nicely and looking good but we're getting some roots out to the edge here still really small though but it eventually will do what this is doing right here. So like I said, it's been several weeks since I showed you guys this and my daughter and I were eating this stuff, but it's still sending up more and more shoots all the time. Let's get down at the stock there. Look at how big that's getting. So this is proof that you really can grow celery from a grocery store stock of celery. Now, if I were to go plant this out in my garden, it would probably just grow big through the summer and I may do that I'm just keeping it in this hoop house right now to keep it protected and doing okay but kind of fun so that's it we got all kinds of celery growing and this stuff was just originally from the grocery store I thought it was pretty cool anyway I hope you guys like this video did you like it mm -hmm. I liked it <laughs> if you did hit the like button subscribe if you want to follow along and see more fun videos like this have a fantastic week and I'll see you in the next video adios